Welcome, welcome back at I need help at C square. In this example, we need to find out if uh, these two lines given by these two equations are parallel, perpendicular, or neither, and the same for part B. How are we going to find that? We're going to have to find the slope of each line and see if they are the same slopes, then we have parallel lines. If they are negative reciprocal, then they are perpendicular. If the slope are not the same and they are not negative reciprocal, then we have the last choice, which is neither. So for that reason, you take each equation. So for example, I'm going to take the first one, 4x plus 3y equals 63, and you want to solve for y. So how are we going to solve for y? The first step will be to subtract 4x to get rid of the positive 4x. Always start with the x terms. And the last step here to solve for y will be to divide by 3, which is going to give us y equals n. Notice here I will break the fraction in two parts like this, negative 4 over 3x plus 63 over 3. And if you want to simplify the last part, 63 over 3, that's great. However, the only thing we need is this number, this coefficient of x, which is negative 4 third and which is the slope of the line given by the equation 4x plus 3y equals 63. Similar, we're going to do the second line in this problem, 12x minus 9y equals 27. I'm going to subtract 12x on both sides. Then I have negative 9y equals negative 12x plus 27. And obviously the last step here to solve for y is to divide by negative 9. And we end up with the equation y equal negative 12 over negative 9x plus 27 over negative 9. Again, this coefficient, this number in front of x is the slope. You notice we have two negatives which they cancel out. So we have 12 for over 9. And both 12 and 9 are divisible by 3. We can simplify and we get 4 thirds. The second slope is 4 thirds. So now we look into M1 and M2, these two. And we notice they are not the same. They are not negative reciprocal. So these two lines here are neither parallel nor perpendicular. They just intersect. Let's go to this part B where we need to find out if these two lines are parallel, perpendicular, or neither. For this one, I'm going to use a graphical approach first because I think it's easy and fast. You should remember that x equals 4 means a vertical line that passes through the x axis at x equals 4. This is x equals 4. And y equals negative 2 is a horizontal line that passes at y equals negative 2. Okay. And we notice these two are perpendicular. You always have this situation when you have a vertical line and a horizontal line. If you want to take a look to the slopes, the slope of x equals 4, which I'm going to call m1, is undefined vertical line okay and for the second one y equals negative 2 the slope is 0 these two are negative reciprocal if you want to call them like that if you enjoy this video clip don't forget to click the like button and come back on c square for more help thank you